So, um, I haven't posted anything in a while. It's not since I was um, overseas and did a pilgrimage over there in Europe. But um, I'm still hoping to put something together like that because I do think that there is something really um, that I'd like to share about um, how having how my own placing of a purpose on um, if you, if you you know move through the universe with a purpose. And you do so within a spiritual practice or belief that it it's a it's a great way to travel through the universe. <laughs> you know, um, yeah. Just I, was, I still want to do content like that. I just I really haven't I haven't felt it. It was a really weird experience coming back from Europe to the U.S. Um, it was like uh, it was like. <laughs> I don't know. It it was really jarring. And it's really odd because I reached something over there and coming back here, I've I've had difficulty maintaining a connection with that. Or I feel like coming back here into my own life was um was like harmful. Like the light just being here in my own life was um it wasn't sad. It wasn't depressing, but it was like, it. it's a different, it's like it, the outcome, how I feel inside at the end of the day in what I do uh, doesn't seem to compare to being on a journey towards some spiritual destination. So I still want to make that content. I have other ACAST content I want to make as well. It's not all about pilgrimage and spiritual journeys. Um, I've been, I do feel that I have an obligation to make content related to my experiences, uh, with somebody with late diagnosis ASD. Um, when I went to look for literature or any sort of like hitchhiker's guide to the galaxy about late diagnosis ASD, like a guidebook, you know, like a great book about it. There's like only one book <laughs> that was written like a few years ago by a guy. So it's not like this is, you know, it's not like you get anything. It's, it's, and it's not like it, there's a real sea change. It's just, I feel a lot more comfortable about who I am. <laughs> and that's about it. I feel happy. But, um, yeah. So, yeah. So I'm going to do some content. Um, I, one is about my ex-girlfriend who is kind of notorious. And then one about, um, some of my experiences with, I had a factitious disorder imposed upon me with regards to my autism that kept me agnosognosia for a very long time. So something about that. And then I want to also do content just about other things of interest to me. Like I was thinking of maybe doing something about, um, you know, there, there are certain, um, some of my travels have taken me to certain places of the world and I could maybe discuss some of my travels and put it in the context of another social issue that's going on today or find a way to do that and see where this leads. Um, um, I'm, I'm going to put something up. I am putting this up to motivate myself to do it because <laughs> if I don't put this up, I'll be like, I'll never do it. It's that kind of thing. Because it's just me, myself, and I around here. In terms of production. Yeah. I have to prod myself into doing anything. <laughs>